Okay, let's talk video doorbells. It's something we know a little bit about. We run about 2,000 people a day through our website, and that generates hundreds of phone calls a month just about video doorbells. People have questions, they have problems. Uh, so we hear both sides. We hear the good and the bad. That's what we're gonna talk about today. We're gonna talk about the good, the bad, and what we feel is a superior solution. The first thing that I notice right off the bat is all of the manufacturers ring and everyone, they make, they make plastic cases or a composite case. And I think to myself, what else do we put on our homes that's plastic? Even your light fixtures out by the front of your garage, they're all metal. The second thing is they have to be mounted at four and a half, five feet because it's replacing your doorbell. So you've got a field of view just pointing straight forward at five feet up. It's got to have a wide angle lens because it's got to be able to see on the sides of the doors, right? So you got a really ultra wide angle lens. That sounds good until you realize it creates a severe bubble effect at distance. The other things that I'm not too impressed with with them, the apps. You know, who wants an app for their video doorbell and an app for their video surveillance system? They should be integrated into one and perform seamlessly. This is our porch cam. It's an active deterrence camera, okay? It's a true 4K video surveillance camera. Why is this a good way to answer your door? First, it's, it's metal, okay? It's gonna last years and years and years out in extreme weather conditions. It's IP66 rated. Okay, we've got 4K wide angle lens here. We've got on-demand bright LED floodlights here. We've got our microphone here so that we can listen to people. And we've got a speaker here that, that provides two-way communication and siren, which you can fire on demand if you need to. Right here, we've got a motion detector. Now this is different than other cameras. Other surveillance cameras rely on the pixel monitoring on video surveillance uh, MVRs, recording units. This is physically built onto the camera, so it's a lot more reliable and it works great. The camera can be wall or ceiling mounted. You only pull one Cat6 cable from the camera to the video recorder. When there's motion, it instantly launches an alert to your smartphone. Oh, looks like someone's at our door. Can I help you with something? Is this, uh, is this Jessica's house? There's no one here by that name. I'm here for Jessica. Please put the package down. Now all of that conversation and that interaction is recorded back on your video surveillance system in 4K. Now, uh oh. That is the problem with video doorbells. Do you want to know the do's and don'ts of installing security cameras? Do you want to know the secrets that the pros use to install security cameras? Do you want free expert system advice on designing your system? We provide all of that for you and the only thing you've got to do right there, subscribe.